example the software view if you are somebody who is looking for an open source image generator then today is a good day for you uh, there is something new that's happening uh, this model is called flux and this is open source and you can also use it by api as of today and as you can see the quality of the image is really on another level and look at that it can also create text on these images and the quality is really amazing as you can see uh, this is uh, really in par with like uh, mid journey uh, but even mid journey cannot uh, come up with long test text uh, this accurately and that's what got me excited to make this video quality and the details look really nice so uh, as you can also see the there is the norm that's used to create images like this and as you can see it's really short so you don't need to have um, a detailed prompt to get high quality image from this model and yeah this is just on another level it can create all sorts of images and the fingers are also uh, really great these are some of the other images um, that you can see that's created using this so uh, i hope you understood like how good the quality is so how we can get it right um, there are like uh, three models uh, from this one so the first one is uh, chanel uh, which is like the fastest model but as you can see uh, the quality won't be that great because uh, this is like the lightweight but it can generate images fast and you can get it uh, from these providers uh, replicate and file.ai and you can also hugging face you can access it uh, but there is no interface api for hugging face so you can use it on your local machine if you have a powerful enough gpu I believe you need 40 GB of VRAM to run this. So yeah, for most of us, like it's, it's just a dream. We don't have to actually worry about it because uh, there are other providers. Uh, there is intended for the developers, uh, Flux.1 uh, dev, uh, this model. But uh, the high quality model is this one, Flux.1 Pro. And you can uh, use uh, it uh, using the api you can also try it on these more uh, these website uh, this replicate one and this uh, this website file.ai uh, it will directly take you here in order to have an account on these websites you will have to have like a github account uh, once you have the github account you can just um, actually sign up using this and you can also get the api from here it's really straightforward and easy to set up and if you want to check out uh, they have like a playground uh, in both website i just created this account uh, to test this out um, but when i signed up for it i got some free credits uh, i'll just show you like see uh, these are the cost associated with it uh, you have like different options to try this I have actually not uh, added my billing account here, but I'm not sure like, but it still shows like $11.65. Earlier when I checked, I had only like $1.5. I'm not sure what's happening. So if you want to uh, access it via API, you can come here and click on keys and just click this button. Uh, and it will generate an api key for you and if you want to play with this and see how it actually works then uh, play with this model this is the pro model uh, as you can see here this is the pro model this is the uh, top end version of this model and you can also select from different aspect ratios and also you can choose the number of images that you want can generate up to four images let me just uh, create a thumbnail for this one this is where i come to generate my image prompts so let's just uh, click on this one so three models are working simultaneously 
to produce different prompts that I can test with my image generator. Uh, this is how I usually test out uh, different ideas. Now, and let me just paste it here. Uh, a description a cartoon share robot with white shock eyes and an open mouth holding a broken journey logo okay let's just give it landscape this is the default guidance scale so let's keep it as default and let's just create one image let's just run it if this is good i'll keep it for the youtube thumbnail so you can generate your youtube thumbnail using this one Oh, this is great i think the text journey killer uh, the spelling is all correct so uh, that's why this model is really great uh, you can get some awesome images i'll just download it since i don't have that many credits i'll just download it and as you can see each image will cost you like five cents so if you have one dollar um, in your account you can just create 20 images oh this is definitely going to uh, make all the other image generators uh, uh, run for their money because this is uh, really great and uh, i the main issue i had with the ideogram uh, which is my favorite tool because it's free and the quality is excellent and the test adherence is also really great uh, the issue was with uh, because they don't have an api uh, since i use make automation i make for a lot of my automation uh, um, having an api is really important for me so uh, if you are not that tech savvy if you can follow this documentation you can easily integrate it with any automation tool uh, if they have this http module or something similar uh, you can just see this uh, this is how you need to have it. I am using the uh, dev version um, basically uh, here. Uh, but we can actually use the, uh, this is the URL that you want to have. Uh, it's a post request. Uh, you need to have the authorization as the key. And in the value, you have to have your key here. Uh, type in key and give it a space, then uh, paste in your a api api key uh, which i already told you from where you can get uh, uh, you can get it from the keys here uh, add key and just give it a name and uh, from there uh, where was i uh, yeah uh, then you have to select a raw as the body type and then uh, json and you can just give your prompt here in between in, the, in this section um, you can also change the aspect ratio um, that's the only main thing that we need to worry about um, so in order to test it let's uh, just uh, a beautiful woman uh, with a board so let's keep it a landscape if you want to change the image size uh, you can go to the documentation here uh, you, you can uh, have it like this landscape 16 is to 9 so let's just copy landscape 16 is to 9 uh, you can also have like landscape 4 is to 3 uh, portrait 16 is to 9 and uh, the square image and portrait 4 uh, is to 3 also so for this example let's keep it to landscape 16 because uh, the since I'll be using this image for the YouTube video now let's click on OK and just run this module really let's see if oh, operation failed with, uh, that just failed because of the double quotes when I gave the text I just removed it and now it's working now I have the image here now let's just look at it and here you can find the url let's just try to open it in the browser as you can see quality is really great 
and it's the text is also really great um, i hope uh, this was helpful uh, if you liked it uh, please don't forget to like share and subscribe for more future videos again thank you for watching have a great day